Nice shirt. All right. You, you got ready to go in? The overseer will see you now. Ball juggler. Yeah. Hey. Frag blower. <laughs> nice. Ugh. S stupid. Yeah. Damn it. Should have covered frag. Nice stutter ass face. Can you, can we turn the can we turn the radio off? I'm afraid of radios. Also, I can't hear much. Hey. So, it's been a while. How have you been? Good. I see you've been growing the beard. Yeah, I'm just playing the game, getting by, working in the lab. Oh hell, man, you know, winning, beating pussy, fucking up shit, bitches, good times. <laughs> I'm just playing the game. Star, I'm only going to ask this once. What? Moments ago, a hologram of a giant armored cockroach appeared in my office. Did you have anything to do with that? Well, um, no. Oh, I see. Very well. Carry on, then. Don't you want to, I don't know, look into that? When something this disturbing happens the night of a traumatic injury, do you think it's wise to work so much? I think it should be looked into in the morning. That's all you wanted? You're drunk. You're drunk. Were you playing with dinosaurs when I came in here? You were playing with dinosaurs, weren't you? Damn drunk. Can I, can I steal all your shit? I'm gonna steal... Okay, I don't know... Um... Does he not care that I can just take anything? Because I'm gonna take everything. I don't care what you say, dude. My freaking leg's been broken for like a day. No one seems to care. Jesus. <laughs> I am gonna shove my science up as much as I can after this. This is annoying as hell. Okay, I finally got in. Only took. Oh, really? God damn it! <laughs> and it was nothing. Are you in trouble? Did he pull you off the team? No. Uh -huh. If you're in detention, I'm gonna have him assign you to clean my bathroom. Oh, I'm gonna bash your face in with a wrench. Jesus. Overseer needs to turn out a damn radio. Good to see you're not. You know. Who's saying that? What are you doing, Dr. Rossman? Yeah, kid. What is it? No. I want to get more experience in science to work on this stuff. This shit is crazy hard. What happened to the external network connections on that old server? Post-apocalyptic politics is what happened. Dumb lawyers doing an engineer's job. Once upon a time, Vault 18 was supposed to be the center of the American wasteland. We had this big machine at the core of that promise. But the Great War screwed that up quick. What wasn't blown to hell in about 30 minutes has been scavenged and sacked for small settlements. You see, the network was a set of cables running all over the country, and this server kept the vaults connected. But one by one, the others have failed. Some were destroyed, others just vanished. Then one day, 18 years ago, they all just blinked out. When the first overseer, a guy named Clint Dixon, took over Vault 18, he severed the links to the outside, said it was a toxic influence. He kept a few cables alive, but severed the rest. It's just been little updates ever since, until they all stopped a few years ago. Now we just have what's left for you to play with. Hope you spot where those weird I.O. spikes are coming from. Uh, are there any other cool things I can work on? I'm done with computers. Your wasteland scout when you can tell me about what's up there. Oh, you want to know what it's like in the great outdoors? Well, let me give it to you straight. It's hell upstairs, kid. A nightmare. The things you think about when you're in the dark and the clawed hand reaches for your shoulder. It's real. And it lives up there. Hundreds of them. But that's just the wildlife. It's the people that make you wish the war had really ended everything.
but he only did half the job. Don't you forget this, kid. The strong prey on the weak. And the closer you get to society, the worse things get. The people that walk around up there are miserable. Half dead. Struggling to see tomorrow. Kids are starving. Families are broken. Those that say they're here to help you are just waiting until you fear for your life. Giving them what they want to keep you safe. Then you realize what kind of slave you've become. That's what the wasteland is like. Don't ever think it's going to change because it isn't. Uh, I fixed the third tier networks. Well, holy shit. I never expected anyone to tell me that. What'd you find? Actually, I found parts of the old external network still working outside Vault 18. This is huge, Star. This means we might be able to get in contact with the other vaults. People haven't heard from us in 18 years. Last known vault we had contact with was Vault 10. A weird little place out in the California wasteland. I wonder if they still got that Nuka-Cola left. But there's probably a bunch of shit you shouldn't be messing with. Could get us all killed if you ain't careful. Now go on. You've had a hard day. You should just head off to bed. There are no death claws under my bed, damn it. Uh, no, I want to get more experience in science to work on the stuff. This shit is crazy hard. Are there any other cool things I can work on? I'm done with computers. Yup. Now that you mention it, I'll let you head up to the main elevator and check out the robotics lab upstairs. Just drop my name at the guard and he'll let you in. It's dark up there. We keep the upstairs reactors offline to save power. So just follow the signs to the main entrance. You'll find the robotics lab at the end of the hall. Last door on your right before you reach the vault exit. Um, okay. Wait, we have robots? <laughs> I don't want to go to bed. Uh, I don't, cause I, I don't want to go to bed just in case. Cause I, I feel like when I wake up, things are gonna be exploding, and they'll be like, "Oh my god!" Hey, what are you doing down here? You touching my girl? Hey, sorry we had a manhandle you off the field. Yeah, shut up, man. Shut up. You, you touching you, Kira? Star, I just need to finish this up, then get some sleep. Yeah, yeah, sure you do. Finish up your pants, bitch. Man, <laughs> I, I loved her. Um. Oh. All right, I guess we'll go upstairs. I guess I'll just keep talking, everyone. Oh, the smoking room, cause it's, oh, that's pretty cool. Oh, yeah, no, no phone. No, you're not getting a cigarette, okay? Got a wrench and I'll kill you, boy, cause I got a wrench and stuff. Hello again. What brings you to the- Sarakata. Just exploring out to see the vault before bed. Oh, well, that's weird. Haven't you seen everything a hundred times already? My head got hit. If you're getting stir-crazy, you should report to the infirmary and get checked out. Vault madness is your responsibility. No one else's. Was there something else you needed? Do you have any juicy fruit? Have a good night. Juicy fruit for me. Let's look at the posters. Aren't you glad you made it into the vault? I don't know. We must prepare. We must be prepared to rebuild everything. That will never happen in a Fallout game. Cause then they couldn't make new ones. Oh! <gasps> oh, you sluts! You should have locked this. Now I have the gun. Yeah. How did Star get um a wrench and a gun? And he has like a number of weapons. How did he? Oh, well, you didn't lock any... Ah, oh, son of... All right, you people, you gotta lock... You gotta lock the weapons. He's, he's running around with a freaking pistol, shooting everyone. Absence makes our time in the vault longer. Your production committee says, stay on the job. <laughs> oh. I just want to explore. I'm gonna be running around, talking to everyone, so... First few episodes, I have a feeling, are going to be like this. A lot of talking, a lot of backstory. Got a bunch of douchebag kids that live in here. Spray painting the walls. Why is Buddy everywhere? I hate you. Stupid kids. 
No. Hey, Jamie. Oh, man. You got annihilated. You okay, little buddy? Hey, I'm not Gilligan. Yeah, Dr. Rossman said you carried me to the infirmary. Thanks, I guess. Dude, yeah. What was left of you? You should have seen it. It was like Johnny was barreling right at you and Bragg was all, Get him, kid! And you were all, ah! And Johnny was all, Grr! Then blam! Then you were all, Splat! Then when I get you to the infirmary, they stripped you naked right there in front of me. <laughs> it was awesome. Whoa! What are, what, are you, what are you saying? I have a feeling if I, if I wasn't gimped, you'd think different of me. Hey, now now that you've seen me without my armor, what do you think? Damn it. See, this is what you need perception for. So you can tell girls that they enjoyed seeing your penis. Haha, <laughs> yeah, awesome. Bye. Night star. I have another boner. Damn it. Don't look at me. Oh shit, the guard's gonna see my boner. He's gonna think it's for him. This boner's not for you. It's not for you. Yeah. Is there a robot in there? Security! Oh shit. Well, oh, whatever. Whatever. Ooh, it's dark. Hi. Need something? No. I really hope your leg gets better. You weren't that bad of a player before you, um, made that fatal decision. Thank you. I appreciate that. You're just gonna let me walk through? Security's pretty awful. Well, I guess they know me. Why is everyone... Aaron Gin... What's up? Nothing. Just... Bye. Oh. Can I steal these? I'm gonna steal some things. That. And that. I don't need a teddy bear. So there has been an update. It's been a day. Apparently a lot of people are getting lost in the vault. Basically just use if if I cannot if I'm if if I'm not getting lost, you shouldn't be getting lost, okay? I got lost in New Moon City, and that's a grid city. If you're getting lost, you, you, you're just you're hope just take your Fallout game, even if it's Steam and break it. Just break it in half. You don't have a sense of direction, like me and my magical compass. Is that everything? Yeah, I guess so. All right. Oh, there's a jail. Oh, there's a robot. Oh, this is gonna take forever. Uh. Hails to the yeah! Initiate patrol routine. Initiate follow routine. <gasps> oh, this Robco Industries Protection Security System is currently down for scheduled maintenance. We are sorry for any of these. This is an emergency. Please contact your nearest Robco. Damn it. Well, whatever. Oh god. Yeah, I get it, phone. You're not getting a cigar. Do 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 Hello? I urinated in the... Oh, alright. No one heard me. I could have taken the stairs, but I'm a man. This is creepy as hell. Hello? Hello? I have a gun. Uh, 
this is horrifying. Hello? I need to get to where I'm going. Oh shit. Oh wait, no. Okay. Hello? I'm gonna save my game. We have robots? Uh oh. Hello dear, how are you? This robot dog is caked with dried dirt and can't function until its internal components are repaired or replaced. Repair 30 or higher. Repair it without parts. This robot dog is now clean to repair but must be powered up remotely. Okay, don't worry, Robo. Domo arigato, Mr. Doggy. 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 I hate terminals for every... thing I do. Battle. Cattle. Ha-ha! Note to future Roboto dog owner. Hello, future Roboto handler. I am Dr. Kyoto, a scientist and wasteland scout in Vault 18. If you're reading this, then the fever I contracted in the wasteland proved fatal, and my canine friend B6 Ark Basark still lies in pieces in the robotics lab. We were on a routine mission studying the native peoples of this region when a strange man approached us. He shook my hand, and on his glove was a green ooze. I retracted immediately, he just chuckled and left. Not long after we were attacked on the way back to the vault, while I grew ill, B6 Ark. B6 Ark. Basark? I'm gonna call him Berserk. Berserk. Dragged me to safety, but destroyed herself further in the process. I built Berserk because there were no animals in the vault. I wanted a friend to make the children happy as they grew up. I wanted them to have a protector. And by salvaging old parts traded for in Union City, I created her. If you have the knowledge, please repair her, en enabling these three commands after she is repaired. Should. Enabling these three commands after she is repaired should restart her operating system. The strange virus may kill me, but my work will live on through her. Thank you. Startup initiated. Command startup boot. Run startup. Run bark I and I. Set follow me. Hello, I am Berserk. B6 Arc. I'm gonna just call you Berserk. Hey, Berserk. Are you gonna follow me? Updating files. Please return later. Oh, Berserk, you so goofy. I love you. Oh. I'm gonna sell these bitches on a black market. Oh. No, seriously, I'm gonna sell these bitches. Oh, that's pretty cool. What are you doing here, Kira? Sorry. Just screamed at you. I want to wake you up. Oh, God. Well, that's horrifying. Let's not go up there. You just sleep here? You sleep here near the goozy open cavern of death? Jesus, Kira, you're a strong woman. Hello, everyone. Who has a radio? I will murder one of you. Stop. Hmm. <gasps> Something tells me I shouldn't turn the force field off and get myself killed. But you only live once. That's science. I don't know what this one is. Where was, uh... Oh, there it is. That's repair, though. Let's 
science skill of 75. Sixty. Was it by two? Three. So it's sixty three, sixty six. All right, I might be able to. Oh, shit. Nice. Just want to check. Before I waste it. Science is at 66. And if I do... Okay, so I can do it. Alright, I'll read these. Dr. Kevin Rossman, entry 1. 